YouTube, what's good, man? It's your boy Adam, I'm back with another video. And on this channel, we are completely geared towards self-improvement and becoming the best version of ourselves. So if you haven't already, go ahead and hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, and hit that bell to be notified when I drop another video. And today's video is pretty simple. It's all about why your dream life is probably a lot closer than you think it may be. So stay tuned for that. And without any further introduction, let's get into it. My stimulant, stimulus package. It's good shit, man. But, <clears throat> all right, man. So basically, as you know, the year is about to be over. 2021 is gonna be behind us. And whether it was good year or not for you, doesn't matter. Because there's nothing you can do about it now. All the stuff that happened in the past this year is gone. Like you should forget about it. It taught you the lessons that you were supposed to be taught this year. And if it didn't go your way, that's cool. That's what this next year is gonna be for, man. Okay? If you feel like you're not on the right path, if you feel like you're not doing what you really love, you can actually start today. You don't even have to wait till next year starts. You can start today and strive towards becoming the person you wanna be. Okay? Because a lot of people don't realize that their dream life, dream body, dream job, could really just be one simple action. Well, that's over oversimplifying it, but it could be one action, one or two actions away from becoming reality. It's just a lot of people don't have the courage or, or the ability to go after and chase what they want. They just sit complacently and think it's gonna come to them. But that's not how it works. Even if you pray to God or whatever higher being you believe in, you have to take action every day towards becoming the thing you want to become it's not just going to happen for you out of nowhere like magic okay you still have to put some actionable steps behind it in order for it to become reality right so I'm telling you right now if you're scared to do something if you've been putting something off because you feel like you're not capable or you're not confident enough just fucking do it do it because that thing could be the spark that leads into the avalanche of events that happen to create your dream life, to create whatever dream, whatever whatever reality you've been manifesting, okay? So just take action, do something every single day that pushes you out of your comfort zone, bro. And I guarantee you're gonna see massive changes in yourself, your person, your character, your values, your ethos, every single aspect of yourself is just gonna change by simply making yourself 1% a little bit better every day. Like in the moment, obviously, day by day, it's like, fuck, man, this is going by begrudgingly slow. Like, when is stuff going to happen? But before you know it, next year is going to start and be over. And you can either make little tiny progress every single day or you can stay like this, stagnant throughout that year. So the choice is yours to make today. You can either take strides and, and take steps to become the coldest version of you or you can sit there on your ass, munching away at some snacks. But at the end of the day, this reality is yours to co-create. So you have to decide who you wanna be, what you wanna do, where you wanna do it, all that. You can literally, your imagination, your subconscious, and your mind is so powerful. You can place yourself in a situation that's like completely different from the one you're in right now, and if you just think about being in that place, being in that situation long and hard enough, you will get there eventually. You don't have to worry about how, you don't, you don't have to worry about what's gonna happen to get you there. As long as you change your mental perspective on where you are, who you are, and where you wanna be, you will get there. Because the universe is gonna help you out and will it to be so, right? So stop second guessing yourself. Stop doubting yourself. Stop calling yourself terrible names. Like there's no room for that anymore. You have to step in to the person you wanna be. You have to act like them, you have to think like them, and you have to carry yourself in such a way that resonates with that person, right? But it all starts with today. So I want you to take your life 
into your own hands. Take matters into your own hands and stop letting life pass you by like another bystander. Because all of us were sent here for a reason. All of us were sent here for a purpose. As I've said before in my other videos. So why are you letting yours slip by? You know what you want to do, most likely. You know what you're passionate about. You know what you love to do. So why are you not taking actions every day to put yourself at the mountaintop in whatever field or industry you want to be in? Why are you doing yourself dirty like that? That makes no sense to me. Because if you think about it, you just put in a year, two, maybe three years of hard work, boom, you could be there. You really put your head down, you sacrifice some of the shit that's not serving you right now, like smoking, drinking if you do that, partying all the time. I'm not saying not to party. Like I said before, you need to have a balance, but you, you shouldn't be doing it every single weekend. You shouldn't be hating your life every week, working your nine to five, and then on the weekend, you don't put in no work to actually make your dream come true. That don't even make sense, bro. How you gonna work eight hours a day for somebody else, but you can't work two, three hours for yourself? Where's the logic and correlation in that? But if you just take some time, give yourself three, yeah, three months. Give yourself three months of doing whatever you love as your career or your profession. Just do it like you're already in the position of doing it like a professional. And you'll surprise yourself by by the amazing things you can accomplish in such a short amount of time. And then after you reach the three month mark, you're like, damn, okay, I did this shit for three months. Why can't I do it for six? And then you hit the six month mark. Okay, now I did this shit for half a year. Why can't I do it for a full year? It just goes on and on and on and on until you become a fucking master to a craft. But again, it all starts today. And it might not even take you a year. You could, like, for example, if one of your hobbies is like a real big passion of yours, you're probably already good at it. So if you just took the actionable step of posting yourself doing your hobby or passion on social media, which is a great platform to get yourself out there, instead of consuming hella social media, if you start producing the thing that you're good at, why couldn't you be a leader in your industry? I mean, honestly, ask yourself that. Like, ask yourself right now, what is stopping you from becoming your best version? Really think deep about it, too. Like, what is in your way that you can eliminate from your life today in order to help you get to that next level? Okay? But that's just some food for thought. And that's also going to wrap up today's video. But as always, if you enjoyed it, if you learned something from it, if you resonated with it, make sure you share this with somebody, anybody that needs to hear this information. Don't forget to help me out. Like the video. Subscribe to the channel. We are on the road to a thousand right now. Actually, you know what? Fuck that. We dreaming big. We on the road to a million, baby. So subscribe to the channel. Hit the bell to be notified when I drop another video. And as always... I appreciate you greatly for watching. I'm going to see you in the next video. Stay icy. And I'm gone.